Hello everybody, this is my name is Honecker and this is a tape for for them to have at NPR. But um I will try my best not to shake the microphone. But there's a cord so it makes noise. But every day, if you want to know who I am, my name is Hannah Krumakala. And every time that I want to be around for where people are, you should know there's a story of my life and it's a scary life that you don't know about. Even if you said for where you want to be, you can know that every day that people want to be around. Have you said for where you are and you want to know about who you said you can be? There's a thing that is called for what you are doing that is sex, but that is fun for where you are that you want to be going around in this human world and meeting and having sex with strangers you think are beautiful. There's someone that wants to take you and drag you to hell ripping your flesh apart. All poles of hell exist so. You can call them riptides. What you have for where you know and any kind of place that you want to be a part of you can say for where you know my name. My name is Hallowell, but even if you said that far away you didn't know the story of why it called the Honecker Hallowell, you can know about the boy called Simba, who if you don't know a story, but they've said, if you knew that there's things around you that people go away or they die and they don't know how to move anymore, you could know this in what is for called death these ways that is happening in the world and just like there are people who see what is if time is space people you have to know always saw so this way and understood maybe ways about that you did not so if you know about the way that if people can be around and the way they see things they understand death right away and know for who you listen for and try to speak to it's not the world that you can subscribe to believing simply is defined as not existing. <clears throat> what you know about where you are is that there's a different kind of world to be and what you have to know about what you play in is this for harmony. Even if I was to try and practice what I said of in the shower then I get the microphone in front of my face it feels very different. But so then if you said that where you go is where you are, you can know that the people and the souls that you talk to are changing in what this world is for a planet. If there's different ways to know about who you are, you can believe that often said for the, how effective is a person just speaking around to other strangers, Alexander the Great was, you can know that people all the time said that if they felt like they were on Mars, they knew Alexander the Great was nearby. Wherefore then, if you know that you say for who you said you are, if I had the planet I was going to say it's called ocean, but if you said for where you are, a lot of people have to know and wonder what is for in my name if they said that I was the avatar. Avatar Simba, or so it is still just Honda but they have a lot of names that you maybe don't know, but being Native American means born in God, born native to lands of free. So where you say you are and what you want to go to and go for is for where you know and anything that you had to know about your own life is for if you knew that you lived to view this life as eternal you would know that you have new names and for fun anyway forever and ever all the ways. And so you said for this in different times for what you know that they've called me gun was hate the boy and they called me, um, they said, I didn't think anybody was using the name Clark as a first name and being good at being famous with that. So my name is Clark Cortez, but that's because there's a girl I love and her name is, she's, everybody thinks that she's Carmen Cortez, who's a spy kid. But every day, she knows about how cool I am, but that's my dancer. And you don't have to know every day what is good, but if you said that, you are talking to your friends and about falling in love and someone have said we have terms for what they said it is but if they said they have some ex-boyfriend who's crazy and abusive and a stalker and they tell all this story for it you have to know that you're looking and saying yes I don't think you did the thing we were talking about that we said we did you know this for and so when you have for this everyone wants to say 
right, these people who want to say everyone's the same ways that they don't have to want to believe in a world where love meant something important and what you had for being in with lovers have to be in a way important for the words is what you have to know about to say is for what is people saying for what marriage was in the first place which any kind of day who you have to ask about where you are is I just thought that if you said sovereign and forever was all it meant you have to know what happens when people use the word elements which is that everybody knows what they are if you heard the word element and you say what is elements and he says oh I'm um, like fire lightning and oh 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 like oh yes okay this um, like bridged into this culture for where you are because this fascination with what those can be is only ever what the word element was there to describe because eternally in any walk of life for wherever you are in any existence you'll be fascinated by intuition by fear um, by just you know, by ideas and how the lightning strikes and home to where you are but the static existing there before was always there and yet for certainly not the same for the lightning to actually have to strike you can't ignore the bolt itself for what it was but to look at the sky above you for where it is now you know there's different kind of lights that you can have from emanating from cities that if you go camping you can see the stars in much better fashion for where you are it doesn't make sense to have a movie that takes away a word like Skynet for something that exists like that that blocks out the sky from what you can see which is a different color altogether the sky is lightning so for what you say if you had for hue or green light which is color but how is hue for if people a lot of the time know that green light is strong for um, where you go and are but why is hue for any color you have it's this for breathing and like over say that you love that you know about it but that's because the air which is green shows every color to you very vivid very strong and if you know who said for what you are it doesn't matter what you want to say about what's going on in what you said for political correctness because the word can't mean anything but evil because you've used policy to change what you could have to say is wrong or right and if you could have to know that you are checking with people for what is wrong and right without this knowing of concept of being for what you are it's something you can over explain to a jack officer you think you have to know about where you are <coughs> and what you want to know but for you said in this that the sky casts black light for you without casting stars or even the trees in shade for what you are um, is for this it's black lightning is conducting it for you a colorless so therefore colored in conductor and the sky is blue when you have to know that it doesn't make every day but to ask questions why is the sky blue is insanity for this and say the sky is every color you can think to have so what you have to know for what's going on when you have to know nothing of what it is for this hour to be eternal for how long it was in these moments how much of your life could actually have passed in the moment from this in these orangest strangest skies for what has happened can you have a whole village and community set up that culturally so important in these era for times of day people always feel like it stretches out for ages in those times when the sky is changing like that what you have for this blue light sky being lasting for so long is only this idea in culturality for where you want it to have to be when you know about the different story for where I was it's that my name is Honda Kaur and I'm trying to get home a long time ago people um, have I was in a different way for you to know about everyone you have to know that when you said for where you want to be it's that I'm trying to get home and find my mom but they've said that they don't know who they are every time you want to speak it's that if you go onto an internet computer you can find my name and read any of my books anytime you want but this for them if this world and love for living culture I've never done anything for money and I don't ever intend to start so what you have to know is what is for where I go and doesn't make sense to me to exist on a planet where you can't understand that the words that we go to and the people that we want to know don't have to be in a situation where you understood that when you have things set up for saying and for what is transit 
it isn't something that's far away if you're treating the the trending of changing to where you go do you have to be Oliver Queen to be wealthy enough to be making sure that if you're traveling somewhere you are either falling asleep right there you're having sex with all your friends and you're getting drunk on the plane and having fun while someone flies you out the amount of time going on and through for something is that time being space for where you go your school in Oregon is not far from the school in Southern California it isn't far away but this peasant speaking of where you are and locked for where you go, it isn't safe to travel in for where you go. Well, separated by danger isn't the same thing as being far away, unless you understood for what has happened, is that you're being held. So where you know for what is gone and what's happening to what you've done, is that it doesn't make sense to live in a situation where we can let isolated cultures exist where they are, for what you wanted to believe in and where you wanted to be, it doesn't make sense to not have way more um, transit changes throughout in areas nearby the Vatican because that is a very scary and evil place that exists only on the idea of isolation and this whole being of around surrounding what they have to call Rome. But if you didn't know for what is gone, we can bring rainbow lights and colored kids playing around all the time. If that tears apart the culture for where you have then we could understand what you had to be, which was human. If only for you know color is for beauty, you have to know that if people were to say that albinos could be born with a skin condition that is simply void of color, you have to wonder what is, even if in your patternings, patternings in textbooks, what is a selling cell look like and for what they are. Can you have a cell that's devoid of color or what is happening for what you were diagramming in the first place? It doesn't make sense for what you know about sun and mineral, but if you said you knew henna dyed your skin, but this for all the time, but a different day and new course for it is even darker, but you rubbing, that's just plant for what you have, but dirt and minerals and foods of every different kind for these coloring skin and if you exist in a world where you have healthy skin as what you are for albino, it doesn't make sense for you to think it can be anything but something that has no love for color and where you are. So what you know about what is going to existing is that there is no person who is helplessly colorless for what they are. And they're not lightning colored, they're not sky colored for what you're talking about. What you're talking about is bleach and speaking in ways for where you say they are and what is going on. I have to tell you this part of the story for where you look at because it doesn't make sense for you to think I don't know who is torturing me when I was kidnapped when I was a little baby toddler and tortured in captivity and um, if live in hell for most of my life there's um four worlds that is said of the person who taught me to read and write told me for how in um, this four people said what if, um, because I was talking about if, when they carve swastikas on their heads, and he was they want to show scar tissue for they don't have bleach or anything, they want to show their KKK for and where they are to cabal and said, Then of others scream more like this, not like we are not the humans. He said, So this and for he was telling me quickly from here and that what is you've heard at the school which is um, for this that you know um, people who said crazy shit or things out loud for where you go is that you know um, there's no such thing as a backward swastika when you can understand the only ever reason to exist in where it wasn't carved for the most maniacal insanity and hell was that you know that anyone who exists in some kind of Nazi termination world to believe in the idea that there was some kind of creature who is a praying mantis that couldn't consider itself a Nazi, a Nazi, a KKK member, the spider, the cockroach, the Chikofisor in any fashion that you look at. You have to understand that that's the sociopath club. You have any stories in your psychology class to know and look at what is happening when they're working jobs and going to business and they were this quiet serial killer for the longest or the waiting to be and they were crueler to people and they succeeded that for what is in business. But you have to know, even if isolated, these people understand they know they are part of this, what you call the Ku Klux Klan, which is older than you would have to get the people arguing for you with. It would be the Jolly Rogers in the first place, as opposed to the Black Flag Free Traders. 
So where you have to know about where you go is you're wandering and looking in the world around you, I guess, every day.